The next feature we're going to look at here is the ability to create a new version of an assessment and duplicate all of the questions automatically. This feature is going to be useful if you need to duplicate a passage-based question. It will also be useful if you're not able to share the assessment. This is going to allow you to duplicate and make the questions your own, so then the sharing level won't matter. It's also going to help with making sure you don't have to go in and edit each question individually. Finally, it's also going to help with the IEP students, giving you the ability to change or modify the questions, so then you have two different versions of the assessment. To create a new version and duplicate all the questions, we need to go into the library. From there, you can either access your library, or you can just use the entire library. I'm going to use the entire library to do this, and it's the same exact steps for your library. I'm going to go ahead and click on 1115 quiz here, and when I do that, I'll click create a new version, and now my options come up. The first one is good if all you want to do is just create a pre-test and a post-test. You're not changing anything, but you want a second test. The second option here is great for those IEP students if you're modifying the questions, or if the sharing level's not working, or if you just want to go in and just edit the questions yourself, regardless if they're IEP students or not. I'll go ahead and choose that second option and proceed. And now all of the questions are labeled by me.